Usually, when you hear beauty pageant, you immediately picture a bunch of gorgeous ladies, all dressed in sexy dinner gowns, catwalking down a walkway. But for the Wadabe culture, it's not quite what you think. The Wadabe people are a nomadic subgroup in the Fulani ethnic tribe of West Africa. They can be found in Niger, Cameroon, Chad, Nigeria, and the Republic of Congo. The people are known for their elaborate traditional attires, as well as their remarkable culture, one of which is the Gyurewol courtship ceremony today's video we're going to learn about the culture where men participate in beauty pageant to get a wife at the end of the rainy season in september of every year the wadabi people all travel to a town in ninja called ingal there they gather and prepare for the kure sale festival a celebration for the end of the rainy season in the Sahara. One of the activities of the festival is the Giorewal ceremony, a cultural courtship ceremony. Before I go further to explain what this ceremony is about, I would like to state that in this culture, beauty is something that is held in high esteem and for the wadabe people a man is considered appealing if he's tall slim has a pointed nose and has white teeth <laughs> during the festival the men spend many hours preparing to look their best for the ceremony they come out in groups to display their painted faces. The painting is usually done with white, red, and yellow clay, black lipsticks, and black eyeliners. This is said to help highlight their facial features, like their eyes, their lips, the whiteness of their teeth, and their jaw lines. During the festival, the men from opposite clans come out to display their beauty, wearing elaborate cultural attires like beads and other adornments. Then, all the contestants will sing and dance to the cultural songs of the ceremony, while the women watch and evaluate the sex appeal of each male contestant. This pageantry is done to entice eligible unmarried women. Okay. Also, since the Wadabi people are a more sexually expressive group, with both genders having the right to change partners at will, married women are also in attendance to assess the contestants in case they would like to change their current partners interesting right i know to ensure there aren't any partialities in the results three female judges from separate lineages pick the winners of the beauty pageants however whoever is eventually picked as the winner would go ahead to win the respect and admiration of the entire tribe as well as become what my people will call hot cake <laughs> of the entire community this is a very interesting tribe and culture and i really respect the fact that they allow people to be sexually expressive as long as it doesn't involve little children like some other tribes i know 
yeah okay so that's it for this video until next time have a lovely day bye bye